Davy Duck. Early one fall day, Davy Duck was taking a walk. Davy Duck was rattling down Daffodil Duck. Daffodil Duck was a nice place to live in Ducksburg Pond. In the spring, yellow daffodil flowers grew and bloomed all around the edges of Ducksburg Pond. Davy Duck liked to waddle down the dock on the pond where he lived. Davy Duck waddled to the edge of the dock and sat down. Davy Duck dipped his orange-webbed feet in the waters of Ducksburg Pond. Nearby in the water was a little girl turtle named Dee Dee. Dee Dee dragged herself out of the water. The water dripped and dribbled down Dee Dee's shell as she walked slowly down the dock. Dee Dee made a trail of little wet drops on Daffodil Dock. Hello, Davy Duck, Dee Dee called. Oh, hello, Dee Dee, Davy Duck quacked. I am a sad duck. How can you be sad on a day like today? It's a nice day, don't you think? asked Dee Dee as she sat down beside Davy Duck. The pond is cool and beautiful. I've just been for a swim. I love Ducksburg Pond, whispered Davy Duck to the friendly little girl turtle. I love Daffodil Dock too. Daffodil Dock is a wonderful place to live, agreed Dee Dee. That is exactly why I feel sad today, quacked Davy Duck. I love our nest in the tall weeds. I love living near the dock on the edge of Ducksburg Pond. I have lived here ever since I was hatched out of the egg, Davy Duck told Dee Dee. I have been very happy here living in the north. Me too, agreed Dee Dee as she drew her four little legs into her shell. Then Davy Duck said, But... Now Daddy Duck and Mommy Duck have told me some news. Our family will be moving away soon. We will be flying to the south. Oh, Davy Duck, I will miss you when you fly south, said Dee Dee sadly. I am glad I live in a shell so I can always stay in the same house. Could I be happy living in a different dock home, asked Davy Duck, in a new pond? I don't think I could ever find good friends like you, Dee Dee. Then, all of a sudden, Davy Duck shivered. Davy Duck's wide orange bowl even chattered. A cold breeze was blowing. <whistles> Davy Duck looked around. Then, Davy Duck said, The weather is getting colder every day. The whole world is looking sad. The yellow furry dandelions had turned to fluff long ago. The white summer daisies in the fields were all dried up. Even the grass had turned brown. Only a few dead brown leaves were left on the trees. Davy Duck leaned over the side of Daffodil Duck. Davy Duck looked down into the pond. I see one big brown leaf floating in the pond. Ah! <gasps> It looks like a little boat, exclaimed Dee Dee. Then the wind blew the little leaf boat away.